Hey, what is up guys? Johnny here back with another Call of Duty Mobile video. Today we check out more leaks for the upcoming season. Once again, a few days remaining till the end of this season. Nine days for the season pass. And once again in the comments guys, people ask me when is the next season pass or when is the rank reset? Well guys, usually it's the same day. Like nine days, this is gonna end. The next one's gonna start like at the same time, all right? So nine days, expect something like that. I mean, since like season one, it's always been like that, never had downtime. So expect nine days, guys. All right, so what I wanna check out today is some new bundles that's been leaked. Bundles are a pretty hot topic, guys. I don't know if you guys saw my video yesterday, but we did talk about bundles. Some bundles are missing here. We did talk about the No Smoking Bundle 1 and 2 that were supposed to come out this season. They never came out. So I don't know if we can expect them tonight maybe or later this week. But still, we have some leaks about upcoming bundles, guys. And it's going to be another hot topic. I know it's going to be controversial, guys, because they are releasing some older free skins that were pretty hard to get. Remember the daily crates like Terrence Brooks, uh, The Police, and Kravchenko? Well, personally, guys, you know I play every day. I collect every crate. I never got The Police. I never got Kravchenko. But I totally understand some other guys that got super lucky and got these crates or these soldiers. They will be super mad because it used to be very, very rare. And now everyone can just go in the bundle section of the store and just buy the police of Kra or Kravchenko or whatever they missed. And once again, they still have to pay for it, right? And if you guys got it for free, you got super lucky. So anyways, we're going to check these bundles, but also I want to check out some crazy, crazy weapon I just saw on Twitter also. Hey guys, before we get into the leaks, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel right now for daily cut mobile videos. It's totally free. Hit that sub button. All right, so now I want to show you guys, before we get into the bundles, a weapon skin. I'm not going to go into the details and show you guys a bunch of weapons, but this one I just saw on Twitter and I wanted to share with you because it's so freaking insane. Now check this out, okay? Type 25 Silver Ghoul that was leaked on Twitter. I mean, usually I'm not a big fan of these weapons with tons of little details, you know, the Viking skins and stuff like that. I like them, but they're usually not my favorite. But guys, check the insane details on that one. Like seriously, guys, they did a crazy job on that one. So many details. I mean, the colors are not super bright. I don't know how it will actually look like in the game. And also, I don't know how many weapons we're going to have of that skin, but really... It might be one of my favorite skin in the future, guys. It's crazy cool. And then once again, I hope we're gonna have more than one because I like to see my favorite skins on multiple weapons, especially my favorite weapons. Type 25 pinstripes is an example. We only have one weapon with that skin so far. It was released in season one. So it's cool, but once again, I would like to see it in other weapons. All right, let's get into the bundles now. First one, again, maybe controversial. Arctic 50 Black Gold uh, used to be super rare in crates. Now you can just buy it straight up. I don't know about the availability, but it's on Twitter right now. And guys, everything I'm going to show you today is from Data Miners Hole on Twitter and YouTube. Check it out. I'm going to leave the link in the description. So anyways, the rest of the bundle, guys... I don't know if you see, but the other weapon, it really looks like it's the Clan Crate AK-47 called Lemon Drop. Also, it, I think it's a mistake. It's not actually the Lemon Drop. But anyways, it really looks like it's the AK-47 from the Clan Crates. That's also pretty sick. It just ruins the whole value of the Clan Crates. Grinding Clan Crates every week for months and not getting that AK. And I'll just go and directly buy it. Then what's the point of collecting the crates, right? If you can just buy the AK, the rest of the crates are pretty trash. It's just uh, basically credits you get because you get the same sprays week after week and some credits. So anyways, it's cool because you can get it if you didn't get lucky in the past. But once again, the a the Arctic 50 Black Gold is such a rare, rare skin. And uh, yeah, I know a lot of players will be super excited to buy that one straight up in the store. Uh, next one, M4 Black Gold. So it looks like they're releasing the older Black Gold weapons. 
that were super rare in crates and now you're gonna get them in bundles rest of the bundles pretty trash uh, looks like a spray and some cards but anyways m4 black gold if you guys been looking for that one is your chance maybe coming back next season now last weapon is the m4 werewolf fighter and i'm sure there's gonna be more there was a rpd and stuff so it looks like they will be releasing a bunch of older rare epic weapons from older crates and uh yeah again leave your opinion in the comments below be respectful but what do you think about that is it okay or is it not okay in your opinion uh i cannot wait to read your comments for real but yeah that one if you guys i mean i'm not a big fan of the m4 but still it's cool for collectors all right so here's the one i was talking about and the next two guys soldier skins in bundles lovecraft chinko here I've been looking for that one forever. It looks like we have the, uh, I'm, I'm not sure if it's the magical eye backpack with that, but it doesn't really matter. Most people will buy that bundle just for the skin, guys. Lev Kravchenko again, pretty sick. And again, I know some guys will be mad. Let me know what you think in the comments. Once again, cannot wait to read. Next one is the police. Again, the rest of the bundle is trash, a frame and a weapon, but yeah people will buy it for the skin only and yeah i know i you know some guys just got it. it it's very rare because you didn't have a lot of crates for that one i mean it was available i think in season two for a while you had some daily crates and then it was gone so it's one of the rare skins in the game guys that was not available for a long time and you could not really buy a bunch of these crates and maybe you could buy one every day for 40 card points cannot remember that one but still, you cannot buy like hundreds of crates just to get the skin, right? So it, either you got lucky and you got it or you didn't and you don't have it, right? Now, last one, some guys will be super happy to get that one. Ruined Jungle, I get asked so many times when I made my skins videos. How do you get the Ruined Jungle? Is it gonna be back? It's one of the best Ruined skins, I think. I mean, some of the Ruined skins are less popular, but... This one's very nice for real and the rest of the bundle again it's gonna be called Guerrilla Soldier uh, some battle royale stuff and doesn't look super great but still again uh, green skin green soldier now about the price how much are these bundles gonna be we don't know yet but we can have a pretty good idea if you look at the store right now we do have a bundle with a soldier skin It's the burnout bundle it's got the ruined spades and it's kind of the same um, the same pattern. It was a skin that you got in daily crates last season. And you can buy it straight up if you didn't get lucky. I think there was some of these blue crates in the season pass. And yeah, if you didn't get lucky, you can go in the store and buy it. But the bundle is much bigger here because it's got like four rare weapons on top. And it's 1600 cut points. So... I would expect something around that, uh, at least maybe a thousand cut points for these soldier skins, especially since there's no rare weapons on, on the bundle, so maybe around a thousand, thousand five. We will see guys, but uh, I wouldn't be surprised if, we, if it would be around that price when it comes out, and that is in America. Of course, if you guys in India, the prices are different, but expect something like that. So once again, check out Data Miners Hole on Twitter. They got a bunch of leaks and killing new stuff in Battle Royale. Uh, they got some videos on YouTube about all the upcoming crates in COD Mobile. And also some pictures on Twitter, including all the upcoming backpacks. Now, I did check that one, guys. I didn't see anything that was really caught my eye or caught my attention. But still, it's cool to see the upcoming stuff. The calling card also... It was a pretty big story last week. It's going to be added in the game uh, next season. And I guess it's going to be something else you can now collect in the game. It's always exciting to collect new stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward for the, the calling cards. So guys, that's going to be it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, leave a comment below. Is it okay or not to release older skins in new bundles? Uh, I guess some guys, again, will be hyped for that. Some guys will be mad maybe, but still... Overall, I think it's a great addition to the game. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Smash the like if you did. Don't forget to subscribe for daily Cut Mobile videos. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.